Hello, everyone. Some players may connect the Bluetooth or the device, but in the game, no matter, press any key, the game has no response. In this condition, you may need to use the active mode. Maybe your phone is uh, has with a MTK chip, so you need to use the active mode. So now, this video we will show you how to active active your phone with M1 Pro, and uh, this method is also can be used for M2 and. Uh, M60 and M3. So, first we connect the Bluetooth. Now we connect it. So, first we should switch to active mode, change mode, and press it. We can see the third one, the Android active mode. Uh, you can also, if you, you can also press Control and uh, F3 to switch the active mode. And also, you can use this one; it may be e easy. So, okay, wait a moment. After we enter the active mode, you can see the device version MTK inactivated. That means you haven't. Active your phone. So now we need to go to the setting and open the development option. So first we we find more settings about phone about phone. Then find the software version. Press about six or seven times. You will see you are already a developer. So we back and open the developer op options. Open it. Open the developer options. Okay. And open the USB debugging. Okay. Okay, back. Back to your to cool gamer. Then you need to use the cable, the cable of your phone. Not this cable, not this power cable. The cable of your phone. And the mouse interface. Plug out and plug in your cable of your phone and then plug plug to your phone now it will about debugging set it always allow and ok a moment later you can see it activated that means you succeed to active your phone so now we enter the game now we enter the game, then you can plug out your cable and plug in your mouse. Now we can test it. Okay. And we can play now. So this is the video about how to use the active mode of Vivo.